Well, hello, everybody. This is the stay at home grandma, and I'm bringing you my melon for weaving. I told you all, this is the year that I learned new things. It didn't happen with COVID, it just happened with me. So I'm going to be bringing you new things, and I'm going to be making things. I'm, like I turned on my room in the boho, I'm almost finished with it, and then I will. I'm, I took all the pictures and did a couple little videos in between, I'm going to put them all together. And next week, I'm going to show you the room. The only thing that probably won't be done is the floor, because I think I'm going to wait until after Christmas and New Year, because I have to clean, give my kitchen a thorough cleaning. Um, behind me was the curtains that I think the fox and the rabbit like. I think other people will say, so, excuse me, I'm drinking Pepsi. But um, my husband decided to put in a new door, so it's got lines in it and the inside of the door and everything they took the curtains down my problem is okay what's my problem it's not his that the door both those doors open the other door did not open with the other door that we had on so both doors open and so i don't know when i'm gonna put the curtains back on or what we'll see anyway let's get into this And have a drink. Okay, so this is the IKEA box. Just a little bit. This is moving over just a little bit too. Okay, so this is the IKEA box, and it's light, so I can pick it up. And it says, "I want to kill everybody." Okay. Okay, so I um, was listening to Lone Fox and he does a lot of um, DIYs and he does a lot of um, Ikea DIYs and Dollar Store DIYs and Boho DIYs and just him and um, I'm going to put some of them down in the, in the description box but him and XL McKenna they do a lot of stuff, and I'm learning things because I've been a bohemian all my life. I just didn't know it. Okay, well, I was a hippie back in the 60s, so we'll talk about that another time. But uh, I didn't know it. So, having said that, I just when I when I started my bedroom, I just said I'm gonna change the house around a little bit, and that's what started the whole thing. I need more color, you know, more light, and um. First, my husband said, should you take on a project like that? I said, why not? So, I did. And for the most part, it's finished. Like I said, it happened. This is when I'm glad my granddaughter was in She can play with the darnest thing. So I think I'll take time. More paper. It's really good. Now, I'm just saying that this is a big box. I didn't think it was that big. I'm happy that it wasn't that big. But this is the loom. Actually, it's a kid's loom. Clap. Okay. When I looked at little foxes, because my husband had gotten all the nails, and a couple, I had a couple of old picture frames and was going to measure from there, okay? And when I looked at lone foxes, it, this one right here, okay, it was, ow, it was um, not a lot better than my husband would make, because he's, you know, he can do things, but it was just, let me, let me open it, let me show you what I mean. Now, if I lose a finger in the process, don't worry about it. I'll patch it back on you. I'm just kidding. I'm tired. I had a girlfriend call me yesterday. And we were talking. And in between last week, one of the, the girls who, who, who was 
I was friends with both my mother and her father in the church you know, that we went to. And then I was the minister of, but um, she had lupus, and um, I swear, I think the daughter's 15, and the other one's like 16 or 17, something like that. And she has a 19 year old, 19 could be 20 now, year old son, but she died. And I was like, and we had just written each other Thanksgiving, you know, and she showed me what she made, and I showed her what I made, and so on and so forth. And I'm like, Dad. So I'm talking to my girlfriend yesterday, and I'm getting ready to shut down my Facebook, and I see this name come up. I'm looking at this other young man. This His mother is a very good friend of mine. He died. And I'm like, and it wasn't from COVID. So I'm like, you know, hold your families tightly. Okay, so anyway, this is by Sarah Bader, the designer. So let's see what's in fact. Yeah, so this is the whole room. Now, what he's going to like is the fact that he can put this together with the prop. Now, these I'm not sure. But these are all the color coordination. I've been wanting to learn this for, like I said, like forever. And when I was taking pottery years ago, and I was really learning, you know, how to potter and everything like that, because I have a kiln here now and everything like that. And I think he bought that for me. I think it's been two years since I had the kiln. But um, and I, it's outside, so, you know, I do my firing when I do it outside. Um, but I... And I would walk past where they were, you know, using the looms and weaving and everything like that. And I said, I want to take that. I want to take that. And that was, you know, well laid plans. But that was my plan when I retired to take the weaving. And, you know, because I really didn't have to take the part unless I just want to go over there and fire it. But that would be good too. But take the weaving and um, then I had the stroke. So I've been saying I'm going to weave. I'm going to weave. I have been looking at weaving channels. Like I said, I've been watching long clock and XL McKenna for the last couple of months and I'll put her name down too I will try to remember and um, because like I said I was looking for different styles and I wanted a lot of color and, and a lot of mixed color and I and the reason is because I'm into colors and that's another thing I think that a, uh, a few months ago you read my little article on, on color so a book that I read and I think that that too that book also reintroduced a lot of things that I already knew. So having said that, you know, I just kind of said, well, you know, I'm going to start with my room because that's where I spend a lot of time. You know, I mean, and I don't watch that much television or cooking channels, YouTube, of course, but I do read in it a lot and I do, you know, crochet in it a lot, learning to crochet, crochet in it a lot. And then in my art room, so that will be, I'm going to do my kitchen. I'm just going to because my kitchen is already a really good color. It's orange, and it's really like the sun shines in here. And then in the front room, okay, it's yellow. So the sun just, you know, it just. And so this one had a new coat of paint last year. When they finally get here and they put the windows in, that's another story, okay. They'll be here. I'm, I don't know, but they'll be here. They're paid for. Um, but you know, life is what it is. Um, when they put the windows in in the front room, went upstairs in the bedroom, okay, and in the little bedroom next to me, then I will work on the windows and put window treatment in and stuff like that. But right now, I mean, I have some new curtains up in the, the front room, but uh, I think I'll just wait because they're going to have to pull the windows out, put the windows back in, that's going to make a mess. So, having said that, if I showed you the, the, it's the material that I guess they give you to make something. Okay. So, this is like the cone that they use to take it through. Okay, I don't know all the pieces. I just know. These are all the pieces right here. I'm not sure where they go, so I will have them look at this. So and I just want the scissors. I did my job for the day. I suppose if I look at it, I would know, but I'm not going to fool it. Well, yeah, I do. I understand. And this is. This is 
not go on. So that is about the one that I was going to make, have, have help, help him make, was a little bit bigger than this, the wind, the, with the picture frame. But this is good enough, okay? And although they say this is for a child, I'm very sure, okay, after he said that, maybe even before, after he said that on YouTube, everybody went and bought one because I immediately said, wait a minute, that looks pretty good. And then he worked on it and everything. And like I said, you got to get over and go and give him, uh, tell him that I sent you. Okay, Lone Fox and, and like I said, Exo McKenna. The other one is Tatiana, and I can't remember, or Tati, I can't, Tatia, but I can't remember her whole name. But when I do, I'll, I'll also, because they opened me back up to color and light and form. You know, I mean, because I'm an artist, yes, but you know, I do a lot of everything for, eh, this sounds like I'm whining, but I'm not. But you do get into the habit of doing things for other people all the time and you don't think of yourself and the one thing that my mother used to say is you you have to be true to yourself and the bible says to thine own self be true if you love your neighbor you have to love yourself because it says love thy neighbor as you love yourself okay so i'm going with that okay and you know like i said covid for me i was going to stay home anyway i was retired and that's what i plan to do so planning it and doing it and operating in that realm of, you know, color and light and fun. That's me. So this is the look. So I'm going to have my husband act out and put it together. And then I'm going to take it up in my arm and then we're going to loom. We're not going to loom. We're going to make things. So if you like this video, like, share, and subscribe. Leave a comment in the comment section and I will talk to you all later. I love you. Take care. God bless. Bye-bye. See you in the next video. <laughs>